Hi, my name is Sarah, and today I'm going to talk about the benefits of a coverage called business income. Business income insurance is a type of insurance that covers the loss of income that a business suffers after a covered cause of loss. So what's included in this would be your net income that you would have incurred, your continuing operating expenses, including payroll, and in some instances, extra expenses. This is money that is spent to either avoid shutting down the business or to minimize the time during which a business is shut down. Most of the time, insureds think of losses in terms of a direct loss. So this would be a direct loss to tangible property such as your building or business personal property that may be caused by a fire. But business income insurance is a type of indirect loss. So that would be a financial loss that results from that direct loss, such as loss of income. So let's suppose you're a restaurant owner and you had a kitchen fire that resulted in a total loss. Not only will the property loss, which is the cost to replace your building, be significant, but the loss of earnings that results from your business being shut down for months will also be significant. It could be upward of $500,000 depending on your monthly net income and operating expenses for your business. Suppose the success of a small manufacturer's operation hinges upon one specific piece of equipment. If this piece of equipment were to be damaged in a fire, the cost to replace it might be relatively small. Let's say $3,000. However, let's say it takes a couple of months to deliver and replace that piece of equipment. If this is the case, the property loss could be $3,000. However, the business income loss could be large since the insured cannot operate for a couple of months, resulting in a large loss of earnings. So now let's look at a coverage endorsement that can be added to this coverage. This is called the dependent properties coverage endorsement. So for some businesses, income depends on the continuity of relationships with other businesses. When this is the case, an insured can lose income when property damage occurs at another business. The insured's income therefore is dependent upon another business remaining in operation. Let's say you're a manufacturer, an ABC supplier, may be the insured's sole source of a critical part. If ABC supplier cannot supply the part because of a suspension in operation due to a property loss, the insured cannot complete its work and is essentially out of business until the supplier resumes operations or an alternate product or service source can be found. This important coverage endorsement applies to this type of business because essentially they are out of business if that supplier cannot operate. So some insureds may ask, is business income insurance necessary if I was not operating at a profit prior to the loss? Even if a business is not very profitable prior to a loss, business income insurance still pays the insured's expenses, many of which still exist even if income does not. So take a chance and speak to your local agent and review your policy to see if this critical coverage is on there. And if not, maybe look into adding it. Thanks for watching and be sure to check out our other insurance informational videos.